Hello everyone, how is it going? Welcome back to another video. Now, this is Clash of Clans. Yes, guys, and this is this is my own village. This is my own, uh, you know, a town that I've uh, created myself. Uh, and I have played this game for a few months now. I've never really thought about making a video on this game. Uh, but I really do enjoy playing Clash of Clans. You know, it, it's like, uh, like a no proper strategy game where you need to build your village from scratch and at this particular moment my town hall is at level 10 right and i actually made a poll yesterday and a lot of people selected clash of clans uh, even more than shadow fight 4 and mortal kombat 1 was being selected the most uh, game uh, the most uh, votes came for mortal kombat 1 we'll upload mortal kombat 1 as well but let's take a look at my clans uh, at my village over here as you can see at my base and this is what it is guys you know and uh, as you can see over here i am on uh, the crystal league i this is the league which comes after the gold league uh, and you need to have uh, more than 2000 cups over here in order to be on the crystal league and if i get more than 2200 cups i'll move on to let me show you okay i'm sorry i'll uh, yeah i'll move on to the master league and uh, then champion and then titan so i'm slowly progressing now if you take a look at this particular uh village this particular base uh then most of my uh you know uh towers like uh, wizard's tower and archer's tower most of my towers are upgraded the bomb tower is also there uh and uh, most of my uh you know mines and mining for coins and mining for uh you know this uh, elixir are also maxed out as you can see i cannot uh, do this until i max out my uh, until i take my town hall to the next level so for this town hall almost everything is maxed out i'm just waiting to max out uh, these uh, inferno towers and once these inferno towers are maxed out then i'll focus on maxing out these expos i've already maxed out hidden tesla i've already maxed out air defense i've already maxed out these uh wizards tower as i said i'm also working to you know max out these dark barracks to unlock some more uh troops you know so let me show you what i have unlocked currently see these troops are all trained uh but as you can see over here i have uh, pretty much the basic stuff that we usually have I have dragons i have a baby dragon i have the miners i have the pekka which is great you know i have uh, the uh healer which is great again now, as far as the dark, uh, yeah, dark troops are concerned, the witch is still unlocked. But I have unlocked Valkyrie. Uh, I have uh, unlocked the witch as well. I'm sorry. I have unlocked Gollum. Gollum is not good. I, I just don't like him that much. Hog Rider is there, and uh, I'm probably gonna upgrade uh, the witch and uh, Valkyrie. I think I'm doing some research over here for Valkyries being upgraded. So this game is quite fun, guys. You know, the only thing that I don't like about this game is the upgrade times are so, so much annoying, you know. And uh, there are times where you might take you like three, four days to upgrade one thing. And and the good thing that my base has that I have unlocked all the five, uh, you know, builder bases. I have unlocked all the five. As you can see, let me show it to you. So the first one's uh, over here. The second one's over here. The third one's over here. And the fourth one is somewhere around here and there is one more so overall i have like five uh, bases uh, builder bases already unlocked so let me show you one builder one uh worker one builder is here the second one's here the third one's here the fourth one's here and the fifth one's here so that gives you five builder bases uh yeah there it is two of them so that's the max you can unlock five builder bases that's the max max so you know what let me find some opponents let's try to you know fight some battles over here i could go with single player single player i could go with the uh, multiplayer so let's do multiplayer over here all right guys so i'm gonna try to fight uh, this down over here and uh yeah let's start off let's kill these little things All right, I may not be able to fully clean this up, but even if I get one or two stars, it's fine. One, two, three Pekkas, and we're all gonna go in the same place.
Nice. So that arrow went straight into the middle. You know, so there are some abilities that can be used during uh, the fight. You know, during the battle, during this invasion which is going on. So, you know uh, this thing, right? League Invasions is the rip-off of Clash of Clans. So we got one star over here. Uh, let's see if we defeat, if we finish off this town hall, we'll get two stars. There we go. That's the second star. Not bad. So even if uh, I'm not able to win or clean up the entire town, the entire village, I will still get uh, coins and some cups. Now let's see where, how much. That's the question. How much? <clears throat> how much I'm gonna get? So almost most of my troops are dead. There are a couple of dragons. One over here. There are. Ekas over there, I think two of them, they might do some sort of damage. Okay, now dragons are dead. Pekka is the only thing left. And one more dragon is there over here, but it's not going to be there for a very long time. These inferno towers are insane, man, and that it's, that's it. So yeah, this is nice, actually. We did uh, around 81% uh, damage to the entire town over there and uh, yeah let's let's do it again uh, let's see if i have uh, some more troops to spare okay so let's start the attack again right guys so this uh, these troops that i'm going to use they are a little different than what i used before as you can see uh so yeah let's let's see if we can take them down. I got a healing spell over here as well. Alright, so let's uh, put our dragons over here. Put Pekka's over here. And even the Valkyries. And the other stuff. The other heroes. So I have a healer as well, which will be making my job a little easier. You know. Alright, that's nice. Yeah, now let's break the walls. Okay, there we go. Now we got to finish off this Inferno Tower. You know, that is important. Inferno Towers can kill your characters, your heroes quite easily, you know. Alright. I'm going to put in a heal, healing spell over here. You know, just to make sure that my characters are healing. Because there are two Expos over here. And I don't want them to die that easily. This Inferno Tower will not be that lethal because uh, this tower is targeting multiple, uh, you know, opponents. Which makes it a little easier, actually. There we go. We may actually very well clean this up. Let's see. If everything goes fine. Alright, come on. Or maybe not. Let's see. I mean, the Pekka is still there. Okay, 78%. That's the damage we did. And there is this one more Tesla Tower available, which is going uh, to be okay. So we just have our one hero left, the Archer. But yeah, she's going to die as well pretty quick. It's just a matter of time, but we did the same amount of damage now. It's 82%, a little bit extra than the before, than the fight uh, we fought before. All right, guys, so this is a fun game to play, you know. It's, it's a really fun game to play, and, uh, you know, there are different options over here as well. Like, uh, there is a shield which comes out uh, when someone attacks your village. You know, if someone attacks your village right after that, there is a 15-hour shield, which means for after that, your village cannot be attacked for the next 15 hours. You know, there is, a there is a clan castle over here. You can save some resources over here as well if your, uh, if your, you know, if your containers are full. Uh, and uh, these are the storages, you know, for gold. And these are storages, I'm sorry, these are the storages for the elixir. All of them are maxed out at level 11. Now, once I max out uh, my town hall, I'm sorry, not max out, but I take it to level 11, level 12, level 15, so on. I'll be able to upgrade the other things as well. So at this point, my objective in the game is to get everything maxed out till at least uh, that can be maxed out till town level 11. And once that happens, it will make my town a little stronger. 
So when I upgrade the town hall, the opponents that I'm going to get uh, that will attack my village uh, will be very strong. And I, my village won't be able to handle that, right? So in order to do that, I need to make sure that I max everything out, including the archer towers and the bomb towers and everything else, the exbos, the teslas. So teslas are maxed out, uh, you know. The uh, air defense is maxed out. Uh, the archer towers are almost maxed out. I just need to work on the inferno towers, which are these. And I need to work on uh, these cannons as well. I could max out these cannons too. Some of them are still not maxed out. Then the bomb towers too. All right, guys. So I don't know how many of you guys play Clash of Clans, but it's it's not like one of those games where you just go in and start fighting. It will take some time. You know, it's a game of patience. But, you know, the more characters, the more heroes you unlock, the more fun the game be game begins to happen, you know. Uh, Alright guys, so uh, yeah, I guess that's pretty much it for the video today, guys. If you enjoyed it, give it a like and let's meet again in the next video. Until then, guys, have a great day. Uh, be blessed and have a good one. Bye-bye.